What's up guys, Leopold the Brave here, and this is a new thing that I'm going to start doing for universes whenever we have fighters that aren't very well known, like KO or Alpha. More specifically, Alpha. I mean, KO's show is pretty new, so not many people know him or what he can do, but Alpha is definitely the odd one out here. So I'm going to make it easier to understand where these characters are from and where you can see more of them, so hopefully I can get more predictions, because I need them for the episode. Even my most frequent prediction video makers have been stumped this time. So anyways, let's begin. First is Alpha. Alpha is from a series on YouTube called Tome. It was created by Christopher Neosi, who actually performs several voices on OKKO. OK He's the voice of Nick Army, Neil, Ernesto, and of course, Purd, the Do you have any gum? guy. And in Tome, he voices Kerbifer, Alpha's best friend. Now in Tome, Alpha is in a group of friends with Kerbifer, who try and stop hackers from messing with the game they're in. But during an encounter with some hackers, Alpha accidentally discovers a glitch in the game and comes across this mysterious bug within it. It's called the Forbidden Power, and it has the ability to convert data into human thought. Basically meaning if you used it on someone, not only would it do heavy damage to their avatar character, but it would trick the brain of the player behind them into thinking they're experiencing the actual pain. For example, if your avatar character had their arm chopped off, you would feel that pain in your arm of having your arm chopped off. A pain so intense it was described as having an axe go straight through your arm. Anyways, Alpha and his friends continue their journey to stop these hackers while Alpha tries to figure out how to get this power under control and how to get rid of it for good. You can watch all 16 episodes here on YouTube, including the prequel episode, Episode 0. You could definitely binge watch it in a single day or two, so it'd be easy to catch up to what Alpha can do and make a prediction video if you already know KO. And speaking of KO, he's a young 6 to 11 year old boy. Yes, the show actually says that. He's the son of a hero named Silver Spark, a member of a superhero team called Point that split up long ago. He works at a store for heroes with his two best friends and co-workers, Rad and Waifu. I mean, I mean Enid. En Enid's her name. Yeah. Now, Rad and Enid were two exceptionally well fighters, and KO wasn't. After a while of not exactly being able to catch up, he started to feel bad and wanted to get stronger quicker. And with the help of this mysterious shadowy figure, that's literally his name, KO was able to unlock some dormant power that was resting within him. It's based on rage and very hard to control. Basically think of Evil Ryu with the power of the Satsui no Hado. Anyways, KO continues his quest to become a better and stronger hero while trying to keep this power under control. And and now I think you're starting to see more of the similarities and connections with this matchup. Now for watching OKKO, OK if you don't have access to the Cartoon Network app, you could just look up a bunch of clips of it on YouTube. Many people have uploaded entire episodes just split into little clips, or you could just watch someone's reaction series on it. But either way, I hope this allowed you to get to know the characters better so you can make prediction videos for me to put in the episode. Can't wait to see what you guys think. Leopold the Brave, out.